exalted by God for having aligned these two souls. It is the shared moments of big victories, common goals, and complete unconditional devotion. If you have love in your lives, you can recognize in yourselves the other, and you can forever have the courage to allow the other to hold your heart in the other's hand and give virtue and trust and vulnerability. Life's strongest yet most, most fragile. The relationship you're entering into today as a married couple is truly one of life's most important relationships. It is a gift given to bring comfort when there is sorrow, peace when there is restlessness, laughter when there is unhappiness, and love when it is shared. Real love goes beyond the feelings of romance and bliss. It is caring more about the well-being and happiness of each other rather than your own needs and desires. Love makes burden lighter because you divide them. It makes joys more intense because you share them. It makes you stronger so you can always become involved with life in ways you dare not risk alone. Real love says that you are stronger together than when you are apart. It is not only making your commitment to the right partner, it is being the right partner. For the past two years, I have had the pleasure of watching this relationship grow. <laughs> From the very beginning to where we are now. I have seen them succeed apart, and I have seen them succeed so much more now that they are together. From the very moment they met, it was a relationship founded on laughter and honesty. From the first date, which quickly turned from a fancy Laguna Beach dinner into a much preferred intimate meal of grilled cheese at a local diner, where Zach kissed Dawn for the first time and she ran away, realizing that her affections were too strong, only to be overwhelmed by those affections again and have them reinforced when he kissed her the next day. To the moment when tears ran down her face as Zach made her feel safe enough to whisper, I love you for the first time. They often refer to each other by saying, you are my everything, for that is what they mean to one another. I've watched these two continue to court each other every single day they work together. <laughs> Live together. <laughs> it's true. Is that where we go? <laughs> and all but a few days when they have, when that they've spent together. And if you've been in the same room with them, you know these two aren't just a couple, they are partners in crime. When they are together, they are mere seconds away from laughter, and they are mere seconds away from their eyes meeting when they tell each other how much they love each other. And if you're like me, you know just how disgusting that could be. <laughs> I've also heard some other stories that I can't quite share here, but I do want to let you know that I'll be accepting drinks at the bar later. Oh, yeah. if you're <laughs> it's an <laughs> In the end, be confident that the vows they make together today, where they accept each other, they protect each other and they support each other are promises that they intend to keep. Today, the promises you make to another, the promises you make from the heart, these will be the basis for the lives that you will live together. Ladies and gentlemen, the bride and groom have prepared their vows. That My dearest dog, before our friends, family, and in the presence of the Lord, I do solemnly vow to forever be your devout, loving, and faithful husband. I promise to hold you in the highest of respect, protect you, provide for you, and uphold the honor that is the blessing of our marriage for as long as I shall live. <laughs> For you are my truth, the beginning and the end all of happiness in my life. I vow that my love will never falter, but rather increase with each passing day, with every embrace, and with every kiss, may our bond grow strong. For the scope by which I peer into the future and reflect upon the past is through the lens of my love for you. You are my whole world, my best friend. My lover, my partner, my everything. You are the meaning of my life, and I vow to do everything as long as there is a breath in my heart to be the meaning of yours. Aww. 
Gone to be your wife. Will you love her, honor her, comfort her, and keep her in sickness and in health, forsaking all others, as long as you both shall live? I do. Don, do you take Zachary to be your husband? Will you love him, honor him, comfort him, keep him in sickness and in health, forsaking all others, as long as you both shall live? I do. May we have the rings? These wedding rings are an outward and visible sign of an inward and invisible bond which unites sorry, two sorry. hearts in endless love. The ring is a circle that has no end and symbolizes the never-ending love that exists between the two of you. As you look at these rings daily, let them always remind you of the love that surrounds you and that is between you. Zach, please place the ring on her finger and repeat after me. I, Zachary, take you, Dawn. I, Zachary, take you, Dawn. To be my wife. To be my wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or poorer. In sickness or in health. In sickness or in health. To love and to cherish for the rest of my life. To love and to cherish for the rest of my life. Dawn, please place the ring on his finger. I, Dawn, take you, Zachary. I, Dawn, take you, Zachary. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have it to hold from the state forward. To have it to hold from the state forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness or in health. In sickness or in health. To love and to cherish for the rest of my life. To love and to cherish for the rest of my life. Today, we will release three doves. One representing Zach's life as a single man, one representing Dawn's life as a single woman, and one representing their new life together as it flies off into the future.